Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Golden Man. We are back to let's play The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. In the last episode, we started off the Pirate Stronghold and we finished the Rickety Coaster. So, we were trying to figure out this freaking puzzle. So, I think what we want to do is we want to put it as close to here as possible. I'm going to go in here. Push this over. Go through this opening. Then we want to run over to here. We did it. We did it. Dang it. Dang it. Thank you. Oh, he wasn't. What? So let's pick it up and bring it with us. Breaking barrels. Doing barrel rolls. Actually, I'm not doing barrel rolls. Do a barrel roll. And we, of course, bring these into our time. And having both of these guys is really nice. You have to kind of pack the tickets. This one give me any money? Let's get it. I feel like this block does something. Oh, I guess not. Being up here to see. Where did it? Okay. Okay. Bars are in the way. So. You have to go through here. In the past. What? Wait. Oh, this was the place I already went through. This is where we we want to go to here, and yeah, it shows that. Place. So once again, a red rupee hanging under the sand. Not sure who takes the time to go into a pirate stronghold, bring in sand, and then hide a red rupee under it. And not sure who decides to put treasure chests in random buildings and put treasures in them. But whoever it is, I'm a fan of them. I'm a fan of Miyamoto too. Except when he makes me rage. Once again, another rubber key. So... As you can see, you want to have this. You kind of want to have it right here. Mm, maybe not. You kind of want to have it right here. Can we get through? Yes, we can. Now we can pull the switch. Let's that down. Let's, let's, let's bring a time shift orb through. Which lets us kill this guy. Nah, let's kill us first, though. Which I forgot how to kill him. Now I remember. Actually, I was just sort of having a dirt one. Okay, this would be really bad if I died. Now we'll send them one at a time. I what the you What's your problem? No what? I what did you do with sir? It's our second game over. 
That's pretty sad. Oh, they did not know they did. They just, they just, they just, that was the zip. You know what? I'm gonna see you when back where I was dead. Don't know why they made us go back to the game of dungeon, but I'll see you in a moment. Alright, so I'm back here. And it didn't take me too long to get back, but. And everything's falling. First, my Wiimote, then my microphone. Alright. So, you, the orb is in the place that we got it. You, if you have to go through again, the orb is in that place you have to go Oh yeah, and something I want to mention is I'm gonna die. No. Um, in the rickety coaster, um, you have to get yeah under 30 seconds for the scary, and you have to get. Under a minute and five seconds for the heart stopping. What? There we go. Actually killed one. Yeah, these things can hop into the past. A hop to the past. Not a link to the past. <sighs> Alright, so we have to kill them to progress. Because apparently their presence not being there made that open. And now you see we are at the back at the beginning room. And apparently once we place the time shift stone, it opens that whole thing up, even though that makes no sense. So the whole thing opened up, you saw. Fort Mess are the times of Fort Pierce cause change in the structure. I recommend going outside to further access the situation. You didn't see this door opened up. Let's see what's in here. Oh wait, I think it just leads us outside. Yes, it does. Wait, this was the front door. No, it wasn't. This is... I is back here. Anything up here? Okay. And that lost a lot of stamina. All of it, actually. Echo nuts, art. Um, why oil? Oop. Wanted your spy friend. As long as you have lots of spaghetti. I have information to report, Master. Please take a look. There is a 6% probability these masts are sails from the ship that protects neighbor's flame. You can now set your doubts and ability to search for the ship that holds neighbor's flame. So you can see it points that way. So the ship is the dungeon. Spoilers. Sort of fish. Anyways, we're not gonna go ahead to the dungeon yet, of course. We have to do a whole bunch of stuff, like side quests. But anyways. I guess I will see you up back in Skyloft. So I will see you in a moment. Alright, so I guess I lied. I actually remembered that they were goddess cubes. We could get out here.
so we are not in Skyloft. Now that we have this of car shots, we can claw shot there to that. We can open the goddess chest. And inside is the potion metal. Carry this with you along to prolong the effects of a potion. If you got this, remember to pack lots of potions. Right, so that's pretty much metal. Um Oh, to get out. I don't know why I'm stuck here. You just go back up to this one. And call shot to that one. But I will see you in a moment. Yeah, as you see, we're right here in the sky. I'll see you in a moment when I am over here. Right where the blue thing is that I forgot what it's called. So I will see you in a moment when I'm there. Alright, so here I am at the other Yaddish cube. And if you hit this, uh, uh, maybe, I can't remember if I hit the mushroom or I was just flowing around it. There was a fairy and I scooped it up in a bottle. But anyways, let's open the Yaddish chest and get the heart metal. Hearts will feel more often if you're carrying this. So, sent item check. Yes, yeah, so we have two, two hard metals now. Or two in total. Shiny stuff coming for that mushroom. You can scoop it up in a bottle. But I scooped up the fairy. To get in here, I just went through the water. Okay, did not mean to do that. But, um... How do I- is this a thing I can get into? No. Anyways, I'll see you in a moment when I'm back. In Skyloft. Alright, so I'm back in Skyloft. I checked around the bazaar, there's nothing I could upgrade. I repaired my shield. There's nothing I really wanted to buy. I checked Beetle Shop. Nothing I wanted to buy either, too expensive stuff. Or I just didn't need it yet. And... But, let's get this goddess cube right here. Inside the bazaar. So we get a gold rupee. Maybe now we'll get the things in that. I don't know. I freaking maxed out. Are you serious? Are you serious? Are you serious? You, you, blah, 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 blah. Well, what's my? Still have a medium wallet. Wait. Um, it's my gratitude. 28. Um, don't want to go open that other goddess cube, goddess chest, in case, just in case it has a rupee in it. Because I'm not really familiar. Oh, dang it. <laughs> I'm just having bad luck. Not exactly familiar what each. That thing. Which each chest holds what. But what do you say we go and do another side quest anyways? So Um we can go inside the potion shop owner Birdie's house. Let's sleep in the bed. Yeah, a lot of things are open to us now that we have the claw shots, including, um, um, snark, including, uh, more gratitude crystals. Anyways, let's talk to him. Um, sigh. Uh, it doesn't look like a we went sleep tonight again. Why? Sorry to worry you. Baby just goes on and on like this all night and I haven't slept a wink in. Uh, I don't even know how long. Baby usually sleeps like a sack of rocks. But that was before we lost. Uh, you know what? No, what? Baby's rattle. 
If we had the you-know-what, the baby would settle down, but we lost it the other day. Bird picked it up and speak and flew off with it. Means the bird thought it was food. I don't know. Of course, the bird wouldn't have eaten it, so I think it must be somewhere in this town. I don't know where. Sigh. She would be nice if someone would find it for me. Oh, <gasps> Dad, I'm totally not going to find it for you. Let's go to morning. I actually don't know if it can be... I, I probably actually should have. Yeah, I want it to be night. Because we can also find some other gratitude crystals around. Alright, so... Let's leave out the dough. And... We've been over this, Mom. Mama. Calm down, Pippa. Don't get so mad. How could I not give you mad? It's obviously like they've been giving someone rupees to clean the house. Give them money so you could buy some bread. Keep spending money like this. I won't have any money left to go to the Night Academy. I didn't take that job patrolling just so you could live a life of luxury. You gotta stop doing this. Sorry about that, I interrupted. interrupted. Oh, hey, Link. What could you want at this hour? You didn't hear any of that, did you? There's no way you heard it, right? Heard what? Nothing. It's, it's nothing. Anyway, we got to get back to our patrol, take care of stuff, you know, walk in the streets. So, Pippet's <laughs> mad that we got grad crystals for her. Yeah. <laughs> I think angry cats. Um, more angry cats. Can I run into this tree? Nothing. Not these little. Oh, bug. Ooh, we got a Skyless Mantis, Buggy Prey, with their jaws, stuff like that. Oh, it's our first one ever! Nice. So we want to head over here, find these rocks. Or not climb them, jump across them. Whoa, set him flying. Set me flying, too. With our new claw shots, we can hook onto those vines. Come up here. There's that goddess chest. And we can go up here. Up here we have, you see, a goddess chest that is not available to us yet. And there's a gratitude crystal right here. Alright, oh, right. I'm better to crystal. 29 now. One away from being able to get something from Batero. But anyways, there's this here. Boing oing. Whoa! Goddess Plume. That is a very good treasure. Anyways, what we want to do uh, is we want to dive off here. We want to land right here. Useless rupees. Use our gust bellows to blow this away, and we have to rattle to be told perhaps somebody dropped it. So, huh. 
Now that we have that, we can go back to see the potion peoples. It's a very easy side quest, but it just takes a while to get to because you have to have the cross shots. So let's talk to him. That's the big throttle. You found it! Ooh, sleepy baby. Time for Betty Bye. Ooh, baby seems to have settled down nicely up at the baby will sleep well tonight. Oh, that means I'll get finally get night's sleep too. Thank you so much. I won't forget what you did for me. Five gratitude crystals. Alright. So, that is going to do it for us in this episode. In the next episode, we might see Batero, we might do another side quest, or we might go to the next dungeon. But I'll decide that. So until then, see you then. Peace out.